All right, ladies and guys, finally, got episode two. I finally started playing it. I'm off work. Fuck it. Let's, uh, let's just get started with this damn thing. Because I am behind. Last up off episode one, the media ended up making it seem like, you know, he was, uh, <laughs> his family was tied to the mob. That man was pissed. What the hell is going on? Wait, hold on. I can't hear shit. Oh, crap. There we go. Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Together, we will change Gotham. The Harvey Dent. Gotham's next right, mayor, and eager to know you. Vicki Vale, not interested, and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. Carmine Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Your father knew which hands to shake. He almost got thrown off his building for that. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. Oh, fuck you, fuck. <laughs> this is Selena. How many? I'd have to count the pieces. Falcone's calling card. The chemicals. Where are they? We're all being played in, couldn't you? <laughs> it's the Waynes. <laughs> well, the Waynes are the biggest gangsters in Gotham. <laughs> And now we continue. I thought I might find you here. The news was upsetting for both of us, but you should see this. I know you come here for solitude, Bruce. More allegations about his ties to the underworld. This isn't going away. It's all so public and messy. Tell me all of this is a lie. I wish I could. There are no angels in Gotham, Bruce. Maybe there never were. I've been dreading this day for nearly two decades. I, I hoped it would never come. Forget the papers. I want to hear it from you. The truth is, they were billionaires, Bruce. You can't amass that kind of wealth without making certain moral compromises. It's just not possible. That kind of money taints you. My money has never corrupted me. And I'm proud of you. But you're hardly the norm. He'll grease the wheels of politics 
Falcone was the muscle. Thomas legitimized the whole enterprise with his name. Your father, Hamilton Hill, and Falcone, they were partners. Nothing happened in Gotham without them knowing. Oh. You knew all that, and you never let on. You're behaving like I was part of the conspiracy. I want you to know, I had my suitcases ready. I couldn't stand to be around your father anymore. But then, they were killed, and you were all alone. And I just couldn't walk out the door. Everything I did, everything I've ever done, was out of love for you. I hope you can forgive me. How could I hold this against you? You're all I've got, Alfred. Thank you. I won't let you down again. Yeah, I can't turn your back on, Alfred. This is the first time I've been back here since that night. When the police called me to collect you, I thought they'd finally arrested your father. I couldn't believe a low-life thug like Joe Chill would have the audacity to rob and kill Thomas Wayne. He was simply too well known. Too... too big. Yet, there it was. Wouldn't Chill just run when he recognized him? Well, it's a fair assumption. But he didn't. You always said it was a simple mugging. In 20 years, you've never wavered from that story. I can recall every moment of that night in vivid detail. But maybe that's wrong. Sometimes, we block out things we don't want to face. Maybe there was some detail I overlooked. Possibilities are frightening. I'd only want to ask him one question. Why? My parents could have given him anything. Why would he just shoot them? He was stabbed to death in prison. No one mourns for Joe Chill, Bruce. Sadly, he was mistaken. I just... I can't picture him as a criminal. Not the kind I deal with. In that moment, he was simply your father. I know they got some more clues around here. I know that wasn't it. I love that movie. I saw it countless times at that theater. How long did it play there? Only when you wanted to see it, Bruce. Your mother arranged the special screenings personally. I never knew that. She was always so good to me. Where exactly does the memory end? With my father pleading, you don't have to do this. 
and the gunfires. And after that? Uh, there are considerable gaps in that recollection. Maybe. Do I really want to know? They were assassinated. And Carmine Falcone knows why. Well, there's the first half. Getting you in to see Falcone like this? I don't have to tell you how many rules we're breaking. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm always here for you, but this could land us both in hot water. I pulled all the strings I had with the lieutenant. This better not come back to bite us. Relax, Harv. No one needs to know. We'll be out of here in no time. Oh, relax, he says. <laughs> As if Bruce Wayne won't turn every head in the building. The last time we brushed shoulders with Falcone, the press made us pay. At least tell me what this is about. Look, I'm all for blind support, but I should at least know what I'm getting myself into. Trust me, you don't want to know. No, no I do. That's why I'm asking. I don't ask questions I don't want to know the answers to. I'm sorry, Arby. It's better this way. Fine, fine, don't tell me. But I hope none of this comes back to bite us. I don't want headlines taking away from my debate with Hill. Gentlemen. Uh, what happened? Dude, the fucking game crashed. Ain't that a bitch? <laughs> the game crashed? Are you serious? Yeah, I'm gonna report a damn problem. The game crashed, man. Come on.